Up next is Tyler Lewis. Hey, how are you? Are you nervous? A little bit. Because I am. <laughs> I chose to sing Suspicious Minds because it's been one of my favorite songs for a long time. The Dwight Yoakam version is kind of the musical instrumentation that I'm using, but I'm trying to use a little bit of Elvis's wording and phrasing stuff too because his is the original and you can't beat the original. Just kind of combining a little bit of both and a little bit of myself. That's awesome. One thing I noticed when you really, when you belt, which is, you have great, a great belting voice, when you sing a little on the softer stuff is when you're a little pitchy. Usually it's the other way around. Usually people, when they sing harder, they sing, start to sing flat or sharp. So just be really aware of that, like at the beginning of the song. But otherwise, killer. His softer voice, he needs to really kind of work on that a little bit and, and harness that because that's a, with his big belting voice, that will be a nice tool for him to have. In 1969, Elvis Presley took this song all the way to number one. And nearly 25 years later, Dwight Yoakam remade it for the soundtrack to the movie Honeymoon in Vegas. Performing Suspicious Minds, Tyler Lewis. My favorite part of the whole song was right, right, in the, at the, right before the end there when you took it into that halftime thing, you slowed it down, because that's where you could have made it sound like it fell off the back of a turnip truck, <laughs> but instead you made it sound like sweet potato pie, <laughs> and that's a good thing. <laughs> you, you, know, you know what's amazing is that First of all, you finally got a chance to ride that invisible horse that yeah, you, you when you're singing all the time. <laughs> but I'll tell you what, I'm no Farley Pride, but, you, but your kin folks should be real proud. Thank you. I hope so. So far, so far, you're some sweet potato pie riding a horsey. I don't know what the heck's going on. You know, um, like for me. It's like, first of all, that song's really hard to sing without going to the I'm going which you never did. It sounded like you. Secondly, you know, like, I don't see you as pure rocker. I see you more as that kind of hybrid, like, Roadhammer sort of vibe. So for me, that was completely credible. 
The Rock Glen Rocket rides again. Uh, Tyler, when they told us country, I knew you would not have a problem with this. And I got to tell you, you did not disappoint, my friend. Thank you. Thank you very much.